your professor might ask you to use scholarly peer-reviewed sources for a research paper. What are scholarly sources? What are the differences between popular and scholarly? Don't worry, by the end of this tutorial, you'll be able to tell for yourself. Please keep in mind, we are talking about differences, not good or bad. Scholarly doesn't necessarily mean better, it has just gone through a different publication process. Difference number one, the audience. A popular source is written for a general audience. It will use language most people can understand. It is written to inform or entertain the general public. A scholarly source is written for an audience of other experts in the field. It will often use highly technical language that is not as easy to understand. Its purpose is for academics to communicate with each other. Difference number two, the authors. With a popular source, the author is usually a professional journalist or writer. With a scholarly source, the authors are researchers in that discipline. Difference number three, the review process. For a popular source, usually an editor will review it before publication. A scholarly source is peer-reviewed, which means it is reviewed by other experts in the field before publication. How can you spot them in the wild? Scholarly journals have plain covers that very little from issue to issue. You can find very few advertisements. Scholarly articles have tables or graphs to display research data. All sources are cited. If you have questions, ask a librarian.